Hey boys, it's your dad. I had a good time at the cigar shop. Was having good conversations with a number of guys. Oh man, they're fun guys. And uh, <clears throat> excuse me, excuse me. Uh, did not drink any liquor. Just sorry, boys. I, I I'll teach you guys how appropriately drink it, but it's a little different. Like I said, to me, I prefer soda over that. It's just better experience more just as much calories i think <clears throat> but i had three cigars and it's the way god wants it the girl did not show up today we were planning on uh on the girl kendra thompson to stop by and i really thought it was gonna be crazy um so it was good that she didn't come i really thought we we're gonna talk again for a long time and uh they like said to me, I'm kind of happy that uh, that did not happen because I still love your mother, but it's just hard, boys. It's hard. It's hard being alone, man. I mean, it just feels great talking to someone. And I do it with the guys. That's why I like here. And they're not like boys that you go out with them. No, you just have a cigar and chat. We talked about soups. We talked about <clears throat> politics. We talked about... Um, business like it was just really cool and I just like it and um, it's 1040 yeah I'm trying to make it to the movie at 1050 and I think I'm gonna do it that's so I'm driving a little a little intentional right now <clears throat> don't want to drive fast but uh, yeah I'm excited about it boys hopefully I'll watch the movie bad boys and you know what I'm more excited about is popcorn i really want to watch or i really want to eat some popcorn but we'll see if i can make Ooh, that guy pass the red light he, he's driving fast i'm not driving fast um and yeah like i said it turned out to be good because i really don't want to talk to another girl i really just want to talk to your mother and but nature, boys, this is what happens when you separate yourself from your wife. And I don't want to. Today was... <coughs> today was the court date and I... <coughs> I did not go. I did not go. I don't want to go. I don't want anything to do with divorce. And I know it's going to hurt me. Because you're not supp you're supposed to go with the court. And they're going to turning against me now I don't care boys there's nothing they can do to make me hurt anymore I know what I have to do I have to provide for my family I always knew that the only difference is I don't get angry like I was angry before so this is so sad boys I really want to be with your mother your mother is one in a million it just hurts me so much that she just cannot see how much I love her and how much I care about our family. She just sees what her family tells her to see. I think I can make it. <clears throat> the movie starts at 11.50, but with the commercials and everything, it should be good. But I'm going to at least go over there. Maybe a little late because the popcorn line might be kind of busy. But I think I want to do that, boys, just to hang out. I know I'm repeating it, but again, I think I like this woman for other reasons. I was just wanting to talk to her. And when I say nature will happen, we may kiss. We may even do more than kiss. And it sucks. Like, I don't, I really don't want that to happen. It's just so hard. Like, I watched a video of a priest talked about, it was like a whole paragraph of things that a woman wants a guy to be. It to be nice, tough, all this stuff, like a million things. <clears throat> and then he listed the things that a man wants out of a woman. And he just wants intimacy and food. And they laughed, the crowd, but it's so true, boys. That's all I want is intimacy and food. 
And unfortunately, if your mom leaves me, there's going to be other women that offer that. But that's what I need. <clears throat> that's what every man needs. It's intimacy and food. And I, I would argue that food goes hand in hand with intimacy. You just, it literally feeds intimacy by eating. The, the woman that makes food for you just become more attractive to that woman. So I was so attracted to your mother. She made some beautiful food. The idea that she cared about me to make, to struggle, to take time to make food for me. It's beautiful, man. It is what it is, boys. But I'm still gonna keep on going. And again, I'm, I'm happy that she didn't come. Because I, I truly don't want that stuff. But you can't, you can't go against nature. Push it. I'm just not. I'm not that type of guy to keep pushing for another woman. <clears throat> but if it happens, it happens. And again, it's just so weird. I don't know how to explain it, boys. I was so good not being attracted to another woman because I always had your mother. But now that she's not here, it's been seven months, man. And I'm not trying to be gross but it's, it's a part of being intimate the sexual feelings I have for your mother we, we we completed those interests by having relations sexually and stopping that for seven months it just makes a man go crazy especially if I put all my love to your mother it's gonna naturally I say that word again and again it's naturally going to come out. I'm naturally going to be sexually attracted to another woman if I don't have it with your mother. <clears throat> it's not like we're old. It's a whole other world of understanding. Your sexual life goes down a little bit, and I accept that. But we're young still. And it's just sad. Like, we should have sex together because we're a husband and wife. For us not doing it, it just hurts me, man. It's part of my love I have for your mother. And then even on a small scale, <clears throat> which is just talking, like I want all of that from your mother. I want all of it. And she's not giving it to me because she wants to divorce me. I don't understand that, boys. I made a mistake. I understand, but I'm not going to be a victim of it. And your mom, with the help of her siblings and her parents, they're making her feel like I'm this evil person that I'll always be this criminal person. And that's just not true. That's, that's not true. getting low on gas but I'm right by quick trip it's all close here so I should be good but the low gas light came on but I should be good I don't think I have a headache but popcorn will help me <laughs> my voice is getting a little better <clears throat> I'm still coughing but I had a great time with the guys over there this is really cool. All right, boys. Well, I'm getting to the to the Cinemark movie theaters. I think I made it. It's ten. Yeah, I got a couple minutes. So I'm gonna go. It's gonna be fun. So hope you guys have a good night. And again, it turned out good. 
But that's a sucky thing. Your, your mom will probably do it. I don't think she'll have a guy that will turn down a woman. I just hope that she turns down them. But there are many crazy men <coughs> that will not take no for an answer. So they're going to keep on trying, keep on trying. And I'm not that type of man. I'm not going to force a woman. But there are many men that force a woman. Sad. Some women actually like that. But they truly don't want it. They just like it. Man, it's a big crowd. It's kind of busy right now. I have to park kind of in the back here. All right, boys. I'm parking right now. Hopefully, I'll get there in time. So, I should be able to. All right, I'll talk to you guys later. I love you boys, and um, can I have some fun? <laughs>